Are you tired of 100% CPU usage that's ruining your FPS? In this video, I'll show you exactly how I fixed the 100% CPU usage issue on Windows 10 and 11 and boosted my gaming performance to the max. So let's dive in and fix that CPU bottleneck once and for all. Gear Up Booster is one of the best program for the optimization of your ping while you play games. Using your wired or wireless connection, so get this pay program free from my description and play your game with lower ping. Now the next step we are going to optimize the graphic settings of our windows, so right click on your desktop and go straight into the display settings. Scroll down and go for graphic settings and there you will find out hardware actually keep schedule. Make sure turn on option for reducing latency and improving performance and after applying the settings you also need to restart your PC. After that scroll down and go for the cloud option and add here your old install game of your windows. After adding here your dad's specific game active file now go for the option and set it onto the high performance. Then hit save and close our latest window. Now in the final and the last step we are going to stop all the background apps from our windows for hours. For that press windows are together from your keyboard and type here gpedit.msc and press enter. Now go for some configuration. Administrative template, Windows component, app privacy, then scroll down and go for Let's App run in the background, double tap here, make sure to enable the settings, then go for default for all app and set it on default to not. After that, hit apply and click OK and close out the settings. So as first of all, you need to download this Fortnite FPS boost pack on your PC. You can get this file from my official website. I give link in the description. Here is the some registry of my additions file for the gaming for your all this stack of your PC for your CPU, GPU, memory, RAM, network, everything. So as let's go and install this just too fast. To as simply double click here and click yes. Click yes again, click OK, and do the same for all these history files under the piece of And next here is the program folder where we have D3 program on this boost pack. You can get this file from my official website. I give link in the description. So here is the interface. So what setting you need to do? That is got CPU settings for the power profile. Guys, you need to select the bit some high performance for this power plant for the software. Click on the make activate. Set all these options or to disable, select all this slider on the 100%, hit apply, check mark on the bridge some dynamic push enable. You will get this option select out the bridge some high performance. Again from this list, click OK, <laughs> click OK again, and guys, here we are done with our power controller, and this will keep running in your background whenever guys you turn on your PC. Next are the software which is the thermal stop, and this is guys the best software for a GPU optimization. You can get this file from my official website. I give link in the description. And guys, here is the interface of this software. So guys, the settings you need to do here, guys, first of all, you'll find out here this option, which is the performance. So you need to select this option onto the gaming, then check mark onto the high performance, and also follow all of the settings on their PC. Then click on this turn on options and not simply guys or minimize the software and it will also keep running here in your background whenever guys you turn on your PC. If it is not forgot to make sure to run the software on your background before playing the Fortnite or launching your Fortnite. Hey guys, now I'm going to recommend you Gear Up Booster, which you can grab for free using the link in the description. Just launch the tool, select Fortnite, and it will automatically connect you to the most optimal server for the lowest possible ping. As an example, I've managed to reduce my latency by 11 milliseconds, which has improved my overall performance by more than 100%. I've been using this for all the games I play on my PC. So be sure to check it out using the link in the description. Now the next up guys, you need to download the little Gotex on your PC. You can get this file from my official website. I give link in the description. And after that, here is the optimization window for the user Cortex. On the very first step, here is my library section, where you will find out your all the available game or installed game of your PC. So now you need to go spread in the next folder, which is Game Booster. So go for it. And inside here, you will find out multiple options for optimization of your windows, like special, processes, services, and all this stuff. You need to simply turn on this option, which is the auto boost, and click onto the boost now button. This will automatically stop all the user services and application of on your windows and you can check out here the release memory is around 3.68 gb which is a lot of memory for the gaming now guys you need to go for the next step which is the system booster so go for this tab and inside here you will find our system plane and here you will find a multiple option for the optimization now click on the scan button and this will start scanning all of the junk file on your windows once it's done, so here you will find out this clean option. Click on this clean button and this will clean all of the junk data from your PC and help you to improving your Windows performance for gaming. After it, guys, now go for the next tab, which is the speed up. And there you will find out multiple other optimization like disk cache optimization, desktop menu optimization, file system optimization, 
and network optimization. Now you just simply click on this optimize button and this will optimize all the things on your PC in just one click. So after optimization here, you can check it out here 27 items have been optimized. Now you have to go for the next step, which is the defrag for optimization of your games. Now click on the scan button and guys here we are done. After that guys now simply minimize this application or click on this close button and this application will keep running in the background. So guys must you do this setting now here is the last step of this video which is guys actually optimize your Fortnite in-game settings. So guys you need to open this PT. Go for the drive where you have installed your Fortnite. So I have installed here into my this program file on my C drive. Go for the epic game Fortnite, Fortnite games, binary wins before. And this is the drive where we have guys installed over Fortnite. And this is the old the exe file or the launcher file of the Fortnite. Go for the properties of your these files one by one. Go for the compatibility option. Check mark on the disable for spin optimizations. And go for the change high DPI and also check mark onto this option click ok hit apply click ok and do the same setting for your all the files i have already guys done these settings on my pc must you do guys simply close out it now just simply one time restart your pc because the settings which we have done on our pc that will be take effect after restarting your pc so well let's restart our pc and jump into the fortnite and test out the fps in battle royale